Hello, hello, hello. So today I'm going to be talking about the latest fashion to hit the streets of Kenya. So stay tuned to kind of find out more and the best place to buy the latest in trends. People all over the world have started to wear it. The chin guard. So we're, we're heading to Kangadelic to meet Washu, uh, the lady who is behind making some of the coolest fabrics in Kenya. So I'm just driving into the lovely town of Naivasha, about an hour and a half drive from Nairobi. Naivasha is a beautiful place. There's a beautiful lake. If you want to see what the lake looks like, have a look at my video where we went on a boat ride all over Lake Naivasha. Beautiful, saw tons of birds, tons of animals. Anyway, I'll tag the video up here. Well, I'm here with Washu. Yeah, she has created all these masterpieces here. So, good morning. Good morning. The Kangadelic symbolizes the color and vibrancy of coastal culture and lifestyle through contemporary clothing and accessories. We have a passion for fashion and a love for the environment. So, we get our Kangas from Mombasa um, and um, we have a supplier there and we have tailors who customize things for our clients. We do a range of uh, reversible bucket hats, reusable bags. Uh, one of our popular products is the reversible apron. Yeah, so we started doing these reversible aprons um, sometime last year in December. A friend of mine called Heather Atkins asked for those. She lives in uh, Seoul, Korea, so she wanted to take some as gifts. And they become quite popular. I posted on Instagram and I got a client from uh, West Point in Georgia, so we can send in these to her. And uh, we do them with the. Uh, she wanted to know the messages because she was told there that, that um, they're proverbs, so we do the Swahili and then we translate it into English. So it's a reversible apron, it's doubles, it, you can wear it either way, and we it comes with a complimentary reusable bag. been passionate about fashion from the age of 11 so when I finished high school um, my dad asked me where I wanted to study fashion design and I said Italy so yeah, oh, Italy, Italy. yeah. so you speak fluent Italian well that was years ago, that's years ago. <laughs> so, I tried. so if there's any Italians watching this come on down to Washu's and she can have a lovely chat with you you can <laughs> help her get back into her Italian yeah, yeah. <laughs> The client gives us the colors that they like and then we send them a selection. We ship with the DHL, which gets then under a week. And also some masks, we ship some masks to um, South Korea, we ship some to West Point and also to Germany. Oh wow, nice, exporting yeah. masks out of yeah, Kenya, that's yeah, awesome. Yeah. So if I wanted to find your products online and I was in Europe, would I be able to find them on eBay? Yes. Yeah, so I can easily find them, just the masks at the moment. Um, and if some of, say, some friends wanted bucket hats, you could start putting them on eBay easily enough? Yeah, okay. So awesome guys, you hear that? Get in touch. If you want to see Washu's products available in Europe or America on eBay, get in touch with us. Um, here's her email address. And yeah, let us know. And that's a, a fabulous shirt you've got on. Did you make that one? Yeah, yeah, this is a very cool. original. So the real reason I came here was to actually get a new hat. You all know what I'm like about my hats. Check these out, the bucket hats. It's so much fun. All right, guys, I have been joking around a bit about kind of wearing masks on your chin. But just remember, in these terrible times, it's real important to wear those masks properly, sanitize, keep socially distancing, and be safe. All right, guys, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe to Mufasa Mike. Um, if you want to get in touch with Washu, her link is in the comments below. 
And yeah, perfect. Thanks, guys.